It is the Wednesday before Valentine, Valentine's Day, so it would make sense those little heart candies would be a key part of today's Katie's Science Up. You know the ones that say kiss me or go away? Mm -hmm. Hug me. <laughs> of course Mark's heart says go away. No, no. <laughs> Katie, no, maybe no. you're, I know you're, you're kind of the same. You're a little like you don't want, you know. Yes, go away. I like your space. <laughs> oh, and you have your assistant, She's David not, Sears. I'm talking to you, David. It depends. You, stay. <laughs> you don't have to go away. Just crushed there for a second. I know. <laughs> Hurt me. Oh my gosh, I, I learned a lot about these conversation hearts in the past couple of days because yeah. now they're not all the same. They're different, and that had an effect on my trials of our experiment when I was doing it D at home. Different in that what they say or how they're made? I think kind of different in what they say, but also how they're made. So this is, this is your main ingredient for today, the conversation hearts. This was the bag I picked up. These are much bigger than the old school ones, and they're not as chalky. Okay, so and it's so very hard to tell from this from view. The rocks, the candy maker that's well, been around a long time. So right? are so are these. Huh. The good ones. So I you, know what you're saying, Katie, because I like the old ones because they taste better. Yes. The other ones are a little sour, the newer ones. These, yeah, and these are the old school ones you want are the kind of chalky ones. Hey, maybe, Love you. The, maybe the same so, are more sour too. David has eaten so I many want of that, them. I want that I, bag, Katie. These, this bag, they say things like, this says love and text me. That's yeah. where, text me, yeah, please. Yeah, you, you throw that one on the floor. This one says miss you. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> Are we supposed to do an experiment or just eat the candy? <laughs> David has laid claim to all of the conversation hearts. Um, so you can you can have them, except he said he doesn't like banana. Banana is the best flavor. Mm. I'm just saying. Mm. So good. What are we supposed to do? Um, okay, so you need a conversation hearts candy. You'll also need some Alka Seltzer clear cup or glass in water. And so here's you can do this a couple different ways. So. I have some sparkling water, just clear sparkling water. Uh, we used that, that was our trial one. So we put the sparkling water and then we put the conversation hearts in and they're trying to dance around thanks to uh, the bubbles in the sparkling water. I haven't seen them move a lot yet. If you want a little more bang for your buck here, you can use sparkling water and Alka-Seltzer. So that's oh, so what we're we gonna do. Both? We have uh, four Alka-Seltzer tablets crushed up here in the bottom. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to add in some sparkling water. And of course the water is going to make uh, the Alka-Seltzer tablets all fizzy. We've got some CO2 bubbles going on in here, some fizzy action. Go ahead and crack that one open, David. Blueberry so, pomegranate. Oh, that smells Does it matter the flavor? It, okay, I it thought does it was not, gonna spray. It, you it were turning it in sideways. It does not matter the flavor. So then Ooh, you'll put your- that's weird tasting. <laughs> Especially with all those hearts. Okay. <laughs> so you'll drop your conversation hearts in there mm. and it may, it may take a couple of minutes, but eventually oh. the CO2 bubbles are going to help to pick up the conversation hearts, lift them to the top of mm -hmm. the glass. Then the bubbles, uh, the bubbles, the bubbles will burst and then the hearts will fall back down. So they'll kind of do a little dance. You can see there, they're kind of starting to move around yeah, just a little, little bit. There they go. There we go. Yeah, so it helps to have the Alka-Seltzer and the sparkling water because you get kind of double the, the CO2 bubble bang for your buck there and that will get those hearts dancing a little faster. Mm -hmm. So this is something fun. The kiddos can see the, the, the different colored hearts bouncing around there and then you, of course, you You've got a lot of things to, to snack on. There's nothing better than an experiment that you can eat. Oh my gosh, David, Did stop eating these. Like, just like you're getting <laughs> the cavities. I have a lot. I was I got real nervous when we ran into the wrong because these these conversation hearts, the ones that aren't as chalky, right. they're too heavy, so they couldn't be lifted up by by the oh, CO2 those, bubbles. Those. Oh, you did see that? We just lifted up right there. Magic. The green. Look at the green one. Yes. Oh, it's cool. Magic. <laughs> Look at that. That's the reaction we want. It's, just, it's bouncing all around. Let me see if I'm I can turn. I'm sure kids will have the same reaction. <laughs> look at that. So the carbonated <laughs> water. Oh, oh yeah, look at it go. Yeah, so the carbonated water, alkyl seltzer, and the little heart. Yes. Dancing hearts in there. And, and enjoy, and don't forget, um, if you try any of our Katie Science Lab experiments at home. There's a place on ksat.com now where you can go and upload a video and you may see it on GMSA at nine. So show us what you got. How, does, how, how does the cocktail taste, David Sears? I don't know, let's see. Mm -hmm. Well, that's got Alka-Seltzer in it. I'm not sick yet. I don't need well, that. Well, you will be after good, all the candy you're eating. It'll be good for digestion. <laughs> We'll I'll, get you some. I'll drink it in the bed. Okay. Right. Plenty of candy. Katie, thank you You're very much. More on ksat.com.